Mr. Angel. Sorry to keep you waiting. You're a little early. Well, you know, I had a bad line. I didn't know if it was uh, 4 or 4.30. place you got here. Yes, I've been very happy here. Hey, you know, I never had my fortune read before. Does this take long? I'll just take the details now. It usually takes me a couple of days to do a chart. Tea? Do you want some tea? Oh, yes. Thank you. Mathilde, vous pouvez nous porter du thé, s'il vous plaît? Darjeeling, Jasmine, or Oolong? Oolong. Not many people like Oolong. Vous voulez les meilleures tasses, madame? No. You play the piano? No, not exactly. Sing? Well, I can carry a tune, but... So who's this uh, mean-looking guy? It's my father. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. Don't worry, he hates it too. You know, he really looks like one of those uh, guys in an old pirate movie. What's his name? Ethan. Ethan. Ethan Kruzmark. Well, I'll tell you, you know, I never saw any of uh, Ethan's movies. Ce sera tout, madame? Oui, merci, Mathilde. Vous pouvez partir. Vous aurez besoin de moi demain? Non, vous venez jeudi. Au revoir, madame. Au revoir, Mathilde. You speak French, Mr. Angel? <laughs> I'm from Brooklyn. I'd prefer it if you didn't smoke. Oh, it's... It's okay. Cream or sugar? No, straight up is fine, thank you. Now, I'm gonna need your exact date of birth. Sure. It's okay, I was... Uh, on February 14, 1918, it's Valentine's Day. How curious. I used to know a boy who was born on that exact same date. Oh, really? Well, you know how it is, all the soldiers home on leave and all. Hey, maybe we could pull your friend's chart and save ourselves some time. I don't think so, Mr. Angel. Every person's very different. I don't think you'd like his chart. Place of birth? Um, Brooklyn, New York. Why, he was a jerk or something, your friend? Yeah, you could say that. Yeah. So I guess uh, you just didn't get along. You and Johnny. Huh? You and Johnny favorite? Who are you? I was an old army buddy. I thought that you two were kind of a, uh, you know. All right, look, I ain't no army buddy. I'm just the guy who was paid to snoop around. But I tell you the truth, I wasn't born on Valentine's Day. It's Johnny's future that I'm interested in. Johnny has no future. He's dead. He died 12 years ago. Mr. Angel, I'd like you to leave. Hey, look, I know you're probably thinking, who's this creep looking his snitch around and everything? And, uh, hey, look, you know, I don't want to sound uh, nosy or nothing, but, uh... He's dead, Mr. Angel. And if he isn't, he is to me. Well... Must have hurt you pretty bad, huh? We all have our scars, Mr. Angel. Well, look, you know, I don't know too much about this guy, but he must have been really stupid if he let you go. Lies and cruelty come very easy to some people. Goodbye, Mr. Angel. It's a pity. You know, I really would have liked to have gotten my palm red. Could have held your hand a little while longer. I don't think you'd like what I see. <laughs> 